So this is, a, this is a great day for the United States of America and a great day for Japan. And we look forward to many more years of a great partnership, not just in low Earth orbit, but all the way to the moon. So um, we're just uh, really excited with how well it went today. Hanging out, quite literally, <laughs> um, as they coast to the International Space Station. Yeah, and as you can see, they're not in their spacesuits anymore. They are every 45 minutes. Oh, and look at that. Inside the cabin, <laughs> we have our four astronauts. We've talked a lot about firsts, and this mission is an example of multiple firsts for us. A partnership across agencies with the FAA, obviously, FCC, first commercial mission. A partnership across our international partners, um, and having, uh, you know, uh, the Sasaki-san here is an example, and having Soichi on the flight is just an amazing experience for us. But most of all, it's a partnership with SpaceX and our commercial partners. And, um, you know, leaving the team over there in the firing room, everybody is so fired up. They're so excited about this mission. But we're not done yet. We need to keep going. That spacecraft's out there with those four precious crew members on them. And we're going to get them to safely to the International Space Station tomorrow, right? And uh, But it was a beautiful launch today and really excited and thank you. And uh, we will let you know how these tests go and relay information as soon as we have it. In July, the Ministry of Education, Culture, Sports, Science and Technology of Japan and and NASA signed the Joint Exploration Declaration of Intent for Lunar Cooperation. I believe the human space activities will expand from the ISS to the moon. I am looking forward to enjoy the new era and uh, going together for the future. In the next 15 months, we should be flying roughly seven Dragon missions, uh, and this mission represents the initiation of a Dragon in orbit continuously, knocking on wood, um, and uh, certainly is uh, really the beginning of a new era in human spaceflight. A couple of issues with the prop heaters. Those are the heaters that keep the propellant warm for the Draco thrusters to use aboard Crew Dragon. We're waiting to gather more data on that. Meanwhile, the crew are out of their suits. They've probably